<laughs> Hello everybody, this is Lumo back with Sassy. The sensual potato returns for more adventures through Drang Lake. <laughs> this old woman's Him still a bitch. Beak like face. He's quite sexy. I love how we made a hollow in a game where no hollows yeah. exist. Yeah, that's what I was thinking actually. It, it threw me for a loop when I when we first booted this up just now. Because like, oh man, we're hollowed, and then I was like, wait a minute, that's not even possible what wait, are we just that gross the have we talked yes. with aline yeah yeah okay uh yeah what the, the were we i don't know the words but whatever were we going oh we were going yeah, for we were going gas coin our stuff. we're going for gas coin and all the stuff down there yeah so now we need to zippity doo da zippity day let's not get down well, let's get mauled by rats I'm not going to get mauled by rats. I'm too oh, cool for that shit. shit. You see, unlike you, I got good, even though you're further in the game than I am. <laughs> I got good. Uh, we can't make that jump, but isn't that something that we just really don't give a shit about? I don't know. I forget what that is. Yeah, I don't really care enough. It's, it's not a like weapon. It's Specter Spoonjili. Yeah, it's not a weapon, so I don't think we really <laughs> should yeah. give a, like, flying goofy. So now we just need to go to Father Gascoin. Mm-hmm. And that's all we need. Gassy coin man. Do we so, talk to the little girl? Uh, I don't think so. We should. Yeah. We should. We're we going should to. Indeed. This is the ladder that killed me spontaneously after. Yeah, like, this was my uh, first was, death, the remember? One. Besides the uh, yeah. wolf. Yeah. Yeah, and this you was. just like uh, teleported for some reason after climbing up here. Yeah, just like straight to the side and fell. <laughs> it's like wily e. coyote shit. I'm hoping the god it doesn't happen again. I hope it does happen again because it would be funny and this is a funny thing. Bloodborne is to be taken, so yeah. there's an item. Go get the item. Which color item are you? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what an item even is. It sounds very dark. It sounds like a disease. Oh, 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 says you. You okay? Yeah. You have an organinom over there? I have like there? several organinoms at once. Right there at your father's funeral. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, there is a... It, what? There was no funeral in that, was there? There, there is an individual who uh, just uncontrollably climaxes at all oh, points in time, right. yeah. and his father funeral set off like an episode, and he literally just had like, he was living in his own jism prism yeah. as he came and like eight quote, times. I had nine orgasms right there. Anyway, let's and talk quote. to a small child. Let's do it. Woeful grief, indeed. Yeah, right. Uh, we I'm are the motherfucking police. Sensual potato. We're green Benjamin Franklin. Pat protagonist <laughs> eyes. Look at those. What? Oh, they're like flipping out. You see that? Find the girl's mother. There we go. Spoiler alert. She's living in Brazil under a false name. <laughs> We're gonna go to Brazil. <laughs> that good. really weird movie. That movie is so good. I I'll go to Brazil again. I don't know what that movie even was. It had nothing to do with Brazil. It didn't have anything to do with Maybe, um... I looked it up, the Wikipedia article just says that it's named after the song. So I think they made the movie first, and then they were like, what should we call this? And like, well, we use that song a lot. <laughs> and then they just named it after the song. Is there like a synopsis of the film so we can like understand yeah. everything? Do you not? Already? I, all I know is like, he it's met a girl, simple. and she was possibly a tourist. He thought she died, but then she didn't. Then she actually died, yeah. and he became slave to glorious Politburo. <laughs> no, he just dies. Well, he becomes... He, he for some odd reason, is just continuously yeah. tortured he for just, wasting money, which is funny yeah. because, you know... It's social commentary. <laughs> it's funny that he keeps getting tortured because they're like, Ah, you're wasting money! He doesn't so, keep getting tortured. He... No, they keep torturing him. They left him alive. Yeah? Yeah, he was still singing. That's not torture, though. He's just there. In, like, I know, but though. it's implied that he's being tortured because of all the fucking torture instruments. Well, it implied that he was tortured, but we don't know how long. Considering he was left strapped on, I assume they just went back to torture him later. That's your prerogative. That's what the ego wrapped would say. <laughs> people already call us bootleg I know, grumps. I know. I mean, we just got through with Nintendo Land. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> Every time someone like says we're just bootleg grumps, I have to laugh because that's actually a critique that I give a lot. <laughs> and we are that. I mean, there's no. I, I mean. <laughs> We weren't yeah, really like, oh, we're gonna be like. Oh, well, we're not drums. trying, but that's what happens. <laughs> yeah. You know what I think it is though? It's not so much anyone's fault, and this is like all of Let's Play them. It's just us. because they've become it's the be most yeah, famous duo. It's yeah. because that's like a style. 
It's grump style of kung fu. <laughs> kung fu. So like, you mean. Uh, yeah, just like people do it, and it gets attributed to them because they were like one of the first people to do that and be successful at it. Yeah, because there are other duos you know? like two best friends playing yeah. and whatnot that didn't branch that much popularity. But literally, I will be honest with you, the Grumps probably would not be this big had it not been for them using their own fan bases to actually yes. get an initial audience. That is, I can't fault them for that though. I mean, that's that would have happened even if they didn't. No, no, I, it wouldn't have, because they would have had to actually become discovered. No, 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 no. because, well, no, Like, I mean, if, if they had not been Jantran, Yes, I know, Richter, I know, I'm agreeing with that. I, I meant, um, if that wasn't, like, the thing. Because they kind of branded Game Grumps, like, as that, almost, at the beginning. Because they, they announced, like, we're doing this before they did it. Yeah. I'm saying, like, they didn't have to do that. I'm saying, like, even if they just, like, had that channel one day, it still would have gotten that popular because of whatever. Yeah. So, like, they, they can't do nothing about it. They, they're just cool. <laughs> well, no. I, my, my thing is well, more, more like, oh, oh there's a cutscene. That's happening. Father Gascoopy. Oh, shit. Jeez. This guy actually gave us trouble last time. Did he? Um, yeah, I actually had to fight him fairly on the Oh, whoa. <laughs> yeah, you just hey. hid behind a fucking cactus or whatnot. Yeah, you hide behind the cactus. You don't even get the cactus until level 38, okay? Jeez. <laughs> but, dude, if I can't get the cactus, how am I going to, like, check him for prostate? I need to make sure he has First of one. All, you don't do that with the He's cactus. So you do that with shot. the uh, surgical gloves. I also want to know no, why he just, like... You get just, the bad ending if you do it with the cactus. <laughs> you're going to get the bad ending because you forgot a thing. What? Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, I find it funny that you're, like, the one who always, like, platinums yeah, a fucking... I will. You will eventually. <laughs> it's an unnecessary setback. Well, yeah, but this will... It gives me more of a reason to do another playthrough. Yeah, I guess. You know? Yeah. To get all the endings. I still want to, like, I would have anyway, because I want to see all the endings. So even if I got the good ending on the first one, I would be like, oh, I'm too bad ending. And I would have gone through it. Cheese, cheese! Without getting all three of the, like, <laughs> sphincters tubes or whatever we need. Cheese, cheese! <laughs> What's that smell? It smells. <laughs> it's anchovies. Cheese, cheese! <laughs> <laughs> You're doing good. Oh, remember that Please time I said all I had... over the shop. Oh, it's gonna cheese you. Oh. Yeah, I'm being cheese. cheese. It's gonna be counter cheese. The counter cheeserism unit. Music box. Oh, I don't do that. It speeds up his moose form. Ah, I hate how much everyone else's gun does. <laughs> right. It, it's really bullshit. You know what I like and dislike is that I really want to enjoy the song that plays during this fight because I can tell it's really cool, but I never can because I'm too busy like fighting this guy. Ah, fuck! I thought <laughs> I had the distance. I thought I had the distance. No! Pierno. One, one pellet. One yeah. pellet is all it takes to fucking kill us, though. Yeah. Like that low health. Like, and then our gun is just like. Oh, 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 yeah, he's yeah. Good. He's good. It, it, the, the gun damage is kind of silly. <laughs> like pellet, like owl poop. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Mumo uh, plays channel. Come for the owl poop jokes and stay because you like owl poop jokes. <laughs> Nah, can I can I actually say something about Let's Play critiques uh, that I find yes. funny? Yes. No, you aren't allowed to say the words. Why aren't you wearing shirts? <laughs> I don't know. I think it's to show off our rippling muscles. A rippling muscles. But no. So there's a subreddit called Let's Play Critiques, which is essentially just like you put subway your, for a second. You put you put your uh, Let's Plays on there, yeah. and people like give you yeah. critiques. Yeah. And the thing is, is my flair on there is the Gordon Ramsay of Let's Play Critiques. Is it really? Yes. Oh my God. Because I'm kind of a dick. Because at a certain point, you sort of start to see, like, very specific trends. No, you don't get to parry. <laughs> and you, get, you see very specific trends, and, like, the joke about bootleg grumps, like, it, it comes from there. That was one of the critiques uh -huh. that we got. And here's the thing, it's a critique I also yeah. give back a lot, because yeah. a lot of people, you can clearly tell, are just trying to be grump yeah. again. Which I always find fucking hilarious, because it's like... Oh, dude, one of our notes was redefined. <clears throat> Somebody remembers Queen. <laughs> I just find it funny, though, because, like... Something about Let's Play Critiques just gets me inherently, like... Not angry, but I guess you could say, like, miffed. Because a lot of the time, it's just, like, trying to be someone else. Yeah, you know? They're not yeah. trying to be themselves. Yeah. And that's the thing about Let's Play. You gotta be yourself. You, you gotta, gotta, like, get yourself, yourself out there. yourself or a green Benjamin Franklin. Yeah, you either have to be yourself, you have to be a great, like, original personality. Yeah. 
Which I mean was, is probably also yourself. Yeah. <laughs> and again, I like I like the way Markiplier put it. You do this long enough, and eventually you get good. <laughs> get good, good. And like that, that A is really encouraging. This still isn't a whip. But B, like if you're not zero out of zero, if you're not being yourself, then you're never actually gonna get good at let's yeah. play. And like, and some people, I mean, everyone can let's play, but some people just aren't very fun. <laughs> everyone can cook. It's like sex. Yes, yeah. Have... Everyone can do it. Yeah, everyone can everyone do it, but not everyone is as good beautiful at it. As Ron Jeremy, full circle, where we'll never oh, escape. Oh god, dude. No one's gonna be as good as Freddie Mercury. Remember that one night with Queen? Oh yeah, I remember Queen. Yeah, I remember Queen. Yeah, I remember Queen. It's a good oh, thing. Yeah. He's a good guy. It's been a, <laughs> it's been like two months since we last recorded Bloodborne, and like there's some guy in middle school who thought that Queen was like the name of Freddie Mercury and not the band. That's, and I, was I like, can understand. I was like, as I get, children, yeah. I can understand as that. Children, yeah, but middle school. Like, well, I'm talking like eighth grade. Oh, school. oh, uh, like you shouldn't be that silly. Anyway, <laughs> but no, like uh, that's the thing that I'm kind of saying. Like we still sometimes struggle with getting our personalities right through the camera. I'd say, not yes, well. Well, that's more of a me thing. But like, why are you fighting these guys? We already got the stuff. Good stuff. But they don't got no stuff. They drop stuff. You're about to drop. Your body! To death! Get him. No. But now, like, that's the thing, is finding that personality and finding that comfort zone through yeah. Let's Playing is possibly the hardest thing, and that's why I try and be rough on people if it's, like, their fourth time through the system, or if I think they're just exploiting the sub for views. Yeah. Like that milk guy. Oh, God, yeah, what the fuck was that about? Okay. Yeah. New story. I lo Riff on other YouTubers the episode. No. <laughs> well, we're not mentioning names. The only people that I think wouldn't mind being mentioned is those Biscuit Lounge guys, but that's because they're, like, making progress. They're actually, like, taking critiques. <laughs> but now, like, uh, fucking... What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, the milk guy. Okay, so I have a rule. I don't like to spread our content because I feel like uh, that guy, you know? Hmm. That one guy's like, wow, wacky! Like... The, the, like, wannabe PewDiePie. The please die pies. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. Because I'm sure Felix is actually far nicer than I gave him credit for. But now, so, uh... Anyway, the thing is, is, uh... I'm trying to think of how to word this without being a complete, like, asinine shitbag. But there is no way! <laughs> when you're talking about asinine shitbags, you become one! Yeah. But now, like... How can I put this... How can I put this delicately? Ah, oh, God, I'm trying to... I'm a reptilian. So, when I, me. when I say that guy, I mean that guy who's literally doing YouTube simply to become, like, popular and famous. Yeah. He's not doing it, like, we're just doing this because we're yeah. idiots and we thought that people <laughs> would enjoy that. <laughs> but, like, the thing is, is this kid, this kid was trying yeah, so was, hard. Like, weird. literally, if he tried any harder, he would have, like, popped a hemorrhoid and just, like... You know what? You know what? That channel, uh, or that video, at least, I can't, I didn't... Whatever, but that one video with the milk, right? Yeah. Basically what it was is uh, he's playing his game or whatever, and then he like dies or something, gets really mad. And uh, just dumps and just milk on himself. Yeah, he, he just like, it cuts from the game and it's just become like, it just becomes like actual footage. He stands up, walks outside with the carton of milk, just looks at the camera and just pours the milk on him. It's like... Wasn't wow. he like screaming or some I shit? I don't remember, but... But like he, the, the thing is though, like his entire it, it's like Reddit thing. account. <laughs> yeah. His he, entire he kept, Reddit account was like different, he kept like putting that up. Like different like, clickbaity attempts at getting mm -hmm. people to click on it. But, and he was uh, like, "Wow, Gamer gets so angry, he dumps milk on himself." And it was like, "Shut the fuck up." <laughs> no one gives uh, a shit poor about you. Guy. I know, right? He never Did sees he it coming see. ever. But um, what, what I was gonna say about that is that like it seems like he was at like a board meeting with himself. Thought like, hmm, this joke will be funny, and then like did not actually like do it. Like he did it, realized that it wasn't funny, and then like did it anyway. Like there's a That's lot. That's the vibe that I got from that video. There's a lot of skit based stuff that I do for this channel that never sees the light of day because it's like, yeah, cause it's just not up like, to snuff. Mm -hmm. It is yeah. not up to snuff. But uh, well, I'm good. <laughs> and like that's the thing. Like you gotta really, like the thing about YouTube is your content does have to be good, at least to you. Okay. At least, yeah, at least. Like, well, that, well, he might have thought it was good, but uh, once again, it really didn't seem like even he was, like... like into it. Like, yeah, you really just, gotta believe... He just, like, his heart wasn't into it. Yeah, that's he, what it seemed like. Because that's because he's not doing this like, as a hobby. Yeah. Like, 
Yeah, That's actually why the Pac-Man V that I was like so proud of didn't go up because I I didn't feel like I did a good a good enough job to warrant wasting my subscribers' time and like that's the thing is like I I you guys are giving me your time I want to give you something good in return. Is this yeah, something I guess dying repeatedly in the hands of this squad? Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, it's the best tactic. My phone is like fucking speaking of. Oh it's god. Probably, what, should we just wait for twenty minutes? Yeah. We're already... <laughs> yeah, we're already just We're already, going. like, way over, so we'll just make it a 20 minute. Yeah, I was gonna waste your time, so... Wait, yeah, it's just waste your time, boy. It's alright, it's good. And, like, as much as I'd like to grow the channel, that's one thing that I... I will forever maintain. I will forever maintain that good content brings in an audience. Sure, marketing helps. Yes. Sure, throwing yourself around helps, but... Yeah, it does, no, you, absolutely. You don't get an audience absolutely. if your content's not good. And, like... As much as I'd like to grow the channel, I'm not going to throw my stuff around because if we're not growing, that just means our content's not up to snuff yeah. as much as we think. Going back to upgrade. Can we buy the whip yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we got the badge. We got the badge. Go and get right. your whip. I'm gonna get the whip. Uh, I'm, I feel more comfortable. This is sort of becoming like a like a weird like pep talk on how to do YouTube <laughs> from some from people who like aren't even remotely popular or famous in in the least. You know, yeah, but at the same... I, yeah, I know, but it's just kind of funny. Yeah, it is kind of hilarious. That but th we're, this we're is like, just... critiquing people in chat, and we have, like, an subscriber. <laughs> I mean, this is just sort of the, uh... This is just sort of because I do so many, like, critiques and everything, like, ask a lot of questions. Like, I try and make myself prominent solely so I, like, understand more of these things. And, I mean, I do have a pretty good understanding of everything. I have a pretty good understanding of how to, like, improve us, how to improve my own commentary. What's weird, though, is I'm going to invalidate everything I just said, actually. <laughs> because here's the thing. I fucking did indie horror games with a scare cam. The scare cam was shit. The commentary was bad. <laughs> and it fucking raked in views. <laughs> like, almost three times as much as a normal video. Well, I mean, the views aren't anything. The... Especially now that they're not anything. No, the, because su the can... subs aren't anything. What do you mean? Oh, no, views aren't anything either, no. Because I can literally look at you for like two seconds because it's like, oh, I like scare cam whatever videos. The quality has nothing to do with it because if it's bad, I still clicked on it and then left immediately, you know? Well, the audience retention was also much higher uh, than normal. Okay. Yeah, our audience uh, retention is weird. We got people who, you know, <laughs> routinely come back. Mm -hmm. But retention is pretty like, poor and I'm like, what's yeah. happening? Why are you clicking on this if you like <laughs> click off within like three minutes? What's happening? What I think happens, though, is I think we have a few subscribers who just, like, are indecisive on what they want to watch, so they just, like, click on it, and then we have subscribers who watch it all the way through, so it, like, evens out. Yeah, maybe, I don't know. It's I, weird. I don't even I don't, I don't I, pay attention to that. Yeah, I'm, I'm the only one who deals with the business end of this channel, let's be real. Business. Well, I mean, when you think about it... The sullied bandage of it all. Yeah, hold on. Can we read those real quick next episode? Yeah. Okay. Know. So, thank you guys so much for joining us. Sorry this episode wasn't nearly as interesting as it normally is. <laughs> So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please comment, rate, and subscribe. If, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. If you guys element. actually want to uh, show me something, and, like, if, like, you want to do YouTube and, like, hey, can I get some opinions on my stuff? Shoot me a link on Reddit or, like, tweet me, send me an email. My, I've got a business email in the about of the channel. Like, literally, I'll go through it and try and help you out where I can. Or girl, or person. I don't really know your agenda. Or your preferred man. But I'm just saying, like... If you want a second pair of eyes, I'm down to help. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. Everybody this watch Brazil. This has been Limo Back with Sassy. <laughs> and oh my god, there are running people outside of window.